serious safety fears have shut down motorcycle racing at Barbagello indefinitely. A young man died at the weekend. Now it's been revealed a damning report exposing serious faults may have been ignored. Six riders have died on this track in the past 16 years. The latest, 21-year-old Chris Adley, who died in a crash on Saturday. His life may have been saved if authorities had acted on a report sent five weeks ago that deemed Barbagallo Raceway a death trap. The Department of Sport says it received the report Thursday, three days before Chris's tragic accident, but it wasn't read until Monday. On Friday we had a director away who's responsible for that area. I became aware on Monday and took immediate action. But Nine News has seen emails that suggest the department received the report over a month ago. The track has been regulated as being safe and people are getting hurt there. Motorbike races at the track have been cancelled indefinitely. The 26-page report stating Barbagello's layout and barriers present a critical risk for motorbike racing. The report basically said the track was unsafe. Chris Adley's father is shocked at the revelations, saying if something had been done, his son may still be with him. Both the Department of Sport and Motorcycling WA are adamant Saturday's tragic accident had nothing to do with the track, its layout or its barriers. 28-year-old Daniel Chadbund was killed when he hit a barrier in May and Cameron Elliott in 2009 as his father watched in horror. Every time there's a very bad accident or a fatality, it just brings my grief to the surface straight away and I almost have to relive it. Jane Griliasich, Nine News.